2013. It's 2.55 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. That means we're close to 6 o'clock Eastern. What we are going to show is the Apple algorithm of what the trading ranges were before Apple decided to, broke out, to break out again. And the part that I'm going to feature is going to be these bottoms right here. Once it got that gap up in the icon news, we had hit highs over here. So let's take the highs. And these highs were major, major resistance, and it became a short. Finally, after running over a hundred and some dollars to the upside, you know, got hundred percent of a bot. And the high, high algorithmic buy and sell scripts used with supercomputers in milliseconds, you can never keep up with them, let alone even understand them. But we do, and we can see where we traded from the highs over here of exactly 512.93 down here to the low on a 60 minute level of 585 right in here. Uh, in this particular area where it got support there in the bar on the low. This particular, uh, excuse me, let's make sure that we have that right. It's 499.85 because we had gotten entries in this bar at 499.50, which is on the website, the, these trades. What we're featuring is how the stock finally on a 60-minute level in a high algorithmic program, remember, 512 and some change down to 499 and some change, the algorithm came in, that's a high frequency model, and it brought it right up to 510, lower high, right up the diamond, which made this thing a beautiful intraday short, MMD. And I am going to show this high reversal on a 60 minute. 510, 60 minute bars down here at 502. That means that this thing printed straight down. What does it look like on a three minute? It looks like, let's blow that part of the chart up. Let's take the three minute high reversal here. You can see from the highs where the reversals went to 507 before making the lows down here. This is where the red candles are right now in after hours. So, you know, one of the things I'm telling you now is that when Apple computer drops down to this lower base again, we're going to look at getting long and see if we can get that algorithm behind us. And if the supercomputers super in milliseconds buy it up, well, then we'll take the entry. This is the actual price ranges and volatility in Apple computer. And a lot of the NASDAQ 100 stocks, there was a good six or seven out of the top 100, they all have the same patterns. How to understand to get long on a 60 minute breakout and the dollar price ranges from lows to highs and highs back to lows.